Parts of the U.S. are bracing for a historic bug invasion. It's already underway in the South, and this spring, by some estimates, about a trillion cicadas will emerge. And as CBS's Dave Malkoff reports, a lot of people are bugging out. You're listening to the song of the season sung by male cicadas who have been living on the roots of this Georgia tree since 2011. He just came out of the ground. It all gets started just after sunset when they emerge from the earth where they've lived for 13 years. They don't even have working wings till they molt out of their baby bodies where they're mature enough to fly off. The southern soil just reached the trigger temperature of 64 degrees Fahrenheit. Where's the sound actually coming from? It's hard to pinpoint. It really is, it's kind of an ambient sound. They go to the top of the tree and that's kind of where they do their mating ritual. The eggs then drop back down here, a cycle that happens every 13 years. But this year is special. I think I got one. In central Illinois, Dr. Katie Dana and her son are waiting on the 17 year brood. Yeah, it's a boy. And the 13 year ones all in the same area, overlapping for the first time since 1803, when Thomas Jefferson was president. And you can see other kinds of cicadas. Besides and those ones are still here in Urbana at the massive bug collection at the University of Illinois. These specimens are from the great, 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 great grandparents. We could talk about a trillion of these critters. It's a big number, isn't it? Yeah. All this wading and emerging and molting. How was he able to jump on me if he doesn't even have wings yet? Got rid of that baby body and flew home. <laughs> and freaking out the neighbors will come to an end about two weeks after they pop out of their shells. That is, if they make it to the treetops. Everything eats these things. This may actually be bad news for fishermen because with all the cicadas dropping in the lake here, the fish may already be full and not biting. Dave Malkoff, CBS News, Lincoln County, Georgia.